You can call me Matthew. This is how Jesus Christ, Jesus the Messiah, was born. A young woman named Mary was engaged to Joseph from King David's family. Before they were married, she learned that she was going to have a baby by God's Holy Spirit. Joseph was a good man and he didn't want to hurt Mary. Should he quietly call off the wedding? He decided to sleep on it. Joseph, the baby that Mary will have is from the Holy Spirit. Go ahead and marry her. Then after her baby is born, name him Jesus, a name which says God, God will save his people. Who's on it, Matthew? No, there's more. When Jesus was born in the village of Bethlehem of Judea, Herod was king. During this time, some wise men came from the east to Jerusalem. Where is the child born to be king, born to be king of the Jews, the Jews? We saw his star far in the east. That's why we're here to praise him. When King Herod heard what they had to say, he was terribly afraid, and so was everyone in Jerusalem. Herod brought together the chief priests and the teachers of the law of Moses, all the clever people. Where will the Messiah be born? Bethlehem, Bethlehem, Bethlehem of Judah. You're the place, you're the best of all the towns of Judah. From Bethlehem the shepherd comes, the ruler and the leader. From Bethlehem the shepherd comes, the ruler and the leader. Who's on it, Matthew? No, there's more. Herod secretly called in the wise men and asked them when they had first seen the star. Go to Bethlehem and find the child. Then let me know. I want to worship him too. And the star they had seen in the east went on ahead of them until it stopped above the place where the child was. When they went into the house and saw the child with Mary his mother, they knelt down and worshipped him. They took out their gifts of gold. Frankincense. And myrrh. And gave them to him. Later, they were warned in a dream not to return to Herod. So they went back home by another road. Who's on it, Matthew? Joseph, get up, hurry and take the child and his mother to Egypt. Stay there until I tell you to return, because Herod is looking for the child and wants to kill him. Go and kill the children! All of them! All of them! So, so they, they got, got away. away. Is that it, Matthew? That's all I can tell you. But you could try my friend here. You can call me Luke. I have tried hard to fill in all the gaps. Here goes. When Herod went, was king of Judea, God sent the angel Gabriel to the town of Nazareth with a message for a young woman named Mary. Mary had been promised in marriage to Joseph from the family of King David. Haven't, Haven't we heard, heard this, Luke? Just wait and see. Mary, don't be afraid. God is pleased with you, and you will have a son. His name will be Jesus. He will be great. He will be called the Son of God Most High. The Lord God will make him king as David was, but his kingdom will never end. How can this happen? I don't live with a man at all. God's Spirit will come down to you and God's power will come, come over you and so your baby shall be called the Holy Son of God. Is that it, Gabriel? No, there's more. Your relative Elizabeth is also going to have a son even though she is old. Nothing is impossible for God. I will do what God wants. 
Is that it, Luke? Just wait and see. About this time, Emperor Augustus gave orders to all the names of all the people to be listed in the record books. So Joseph had to leave Nazareth and go to Bethlehem near Jerusalem. Long ago, Bethlehem had been King David's hometown. As Mary was now engaged to Joseph, she travelled with him to Bethlehem. Mary was heavily pregnant, and when they got there, she gave birth to her son. She dressed him in baby clothes and laid him on the bed of hay, because there was no room for them in the inn. Is this it, Luke? That night, in the fields near Bethlehem, some shepherds were guarding their sheep. Don't be afraid! I have good news for you, which will make everyone happy. Everyone? Yes, everyone! Today, in David's hometown, a saviour was born for you. He is the Messiah. You will find him dressed in bathing clothes and lying on a bed of hay. Praise God in heaven, peace on the earth, peace now to everyone, everyone God loves. Is this it, Luke? Just wait and see. They hurried off and found Mary and Joseph and they saw a baby lying on a bed of hay. When the shepherds saw Jesus, they made known that, that what the angel had said about him. Everyone there listened and was surprised. Mary kept thinking about all this and wondering what it meant, how to tell the story, how to pass it on. Is that it, Luke? Just wait and see. Is that it, Matthew? No, there's more. It's your turn now, my friends. It's your turn now, my friends. Tell the good news. Tell